Looks like they'll get a full scout of what's going on in Sela's base. Ukraine stars playing like a champ. Oh. That's for sure. Wouldn't it be something if Ukraine star went on and won Craft Cup? We would 31. have three Zergs in the in the King of the Month. I would also think though this would be the most un one of the most unlikely Craft Cup winners. Look at all the star level players we have here today. That's for sure. There was uh, 50, 50 signed up, fifty top two hundred signed up, and about thirty five of them have checked in. So. Ukraine star, Ukraine star at 29 drones. Sorry to interrupt. No Ukraine problem. star at 29 drones. Sila's at 23 drones. Ukraine star has managed to extract a six, a six worker lead as Ukraine star is now going to move an overseer through the middle of the map. I really like how Ukraine star is scouting. Now Ukraine star has to do a few more trick. Oh no, nice counter scouting. Ukraine star kills the zerglings. As they try to enter the base. Now, is this overseer going to going to contaminate the hatchery? Let's see. No. It does I not even have I... enough energy for it. Oh, there it goes. It just had enough uh, energy for it and throws it down on the spire. So there it is. And Ukraine Star, on the other hand, is getting an evolution chamber, and he has a hydrolyst. Uh, Ukraine Star is at 31 drones, mining off of one hatchery. Hydralis on the way out just as Sela finishes up that spire and pulls out three Mutalisks. And it looks like an expansion. It did go down for, uh, for Ukraine Star, but was taken out by taken these down. Zerglings. Sela playing very aggressive. Let's see what yeah, happens whoops. here. As all the drones come off the line to try to deal with this uh, Zergling attack. And it looks like uh, Ukraine Star will defend against that, but at the same time, Celia did play, place down his expansion. And that expansion is only about 20 seconds away, so Celia could give himself a big advantage in a minute or two. Now, uh, no range upgrade for the Hydralisks by Ukraine Star. Mutalisk harassment for Mutalisks, which are obviously no match for these Hydralisks. Well, they managed to pick off one of the four Mutalisks. The Mutalisks will, however, do a nice job of scouting for Sila. Oh, and here come the Bane Lines. And these, and these Mutalisks are doing some damage here to Ukraine Star's yeah. Overlord. Absolutely. But they will not kill it. And Ukraine Star is now reaping the benefits of the economic advantage he built in the first five minutes of this game. He is cranking out Hydralisks many at a time. He's got to do something with it, though. He is stuck on one base. That's right. And he's going to attempt to expand again. And also, very poor creep spread here by Ukraine Star. No tumors are out. As we do see, Sela has a lot of tumors out on the field. We see also range attack or range upgrade going down for those Hydralisks right now for finally. Ukraine Star. Yeah, finally. As well as level one attack upgrade for the ranged units. And now we do see that uh, we do see the same kind of upgrade going down for Sela right now, but we also notice that there is uh, carapace armor going down for Sela. Yep. And the did you mention the speed upgrade for the roaches for Sela? I have not. Yep. Roach Warren with uh, range uh, with speed upgrade for the roaches being performed as we speak. Contaminate being thrown seconds. down right now on Sela's. Uh, hatchery, as well as a changeling being thrown down by Ukraine Star, trying to get some map awareness, and that queen will take down that uh, that changeling. And look at this spread. Yeah, yep. Sela is definitely winning that advantage. Now, Ukraine Star has got 48 drones. Once he gets the second ba uh, second hatchery up, Ukraine Star will have 20 more worker units mining off of two bases than his opponent. Ukraine Star will be at a pretty big advantage if he chooses to uh, exploit that. Let's see what happens. That's right, and a spine cr or spore crawler going down right now to protect uh -oh. against mutas. Uh oh. But this expansion is going to be seen. Oh, oh. Three mutas. Nothing to do, nothing to react against, but mutal, er, but but uh, these hydralis coming in now, ever prolonging this expansion from being fully down. Yeah, absolutely. Now, if we take a look, um, Ukraine Star is at 38 drones, Sela is at 47 drones, so Sela has gained that advantage. That's right.
And as you said, the Kree spread is way better for Sela. Uh, the C Sela's army consists of three banelings, 11 roaches, uh, three zerglings. And you've mentioned the upgrades for Sela. Sela's really upgrading like crazy. And does Ukraine start having an overseer? No, he does not. Actually, and Ukraine Star does ahead. have an overseer. It is just hanging out at the very north tip of the map. And it has periodically been coming in to try to slow down production here as it throws down corruption on the uh, on the buildings here, on the hatchery anyway. Contam Contamination. 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 Yeah, thank you. Yep. Now, we're noticing seal has got a hydralis den up, and that hydralis den has got range research occurring on it right now as we speak, but it's still like, like 100 seconds away from completing. Um... During all this time, Sila still has 10 more harvesters than uh, Ukraine Star. Ukraine Star's army now consists of... Sorry, Ukraine Star's army now consists of 10 hydralists, uh, eight, 23 roaches, and that's it, and 3 zerglings. So all roach, all hydralisk for Ukraine Star. As well as uh, Celia does have uh, hydralists out as well, and they uh, yep. do not have the range. More, Another, more contamination. Yeah. And a changeling. That's right. For good measure. Changeling's killed, of course. So we got a very simplistic army for Ukraine Star. It's strictly roaches and and uh, hydralisks. The hydralisks are at plus one attack. Or Sorry, both the hydralisks and the roaches are plus one attack. No armor added to them. Ukraine Star works on the rocks and then decides to back off. Both players are sitting off of two bases. With uh, Ukraine Star working with 41 drones, uh, mining from four different extractors. Ukraine Star is supply capped right now at 145 units. Sila is supply capped at 166 units. And basically, sela has got eight hydralisks, 41 roaches. The roaches are plus one attack, plus one armor. 41 roaches, three banalings. So basically, we've got 49 roach hydras versus 49 roach hydras. So both players have a combination of roach and hydra added up to 49. As well as only having two bases on top of that. But there is a there is a third hatchery here for Sela. No third hatchery for Ukraine Star at this moment. And here comes the fourth. The infestation pit by Sela in his main base just laid down. And look at this, Sela moving forward, destroying these rocks in the middle of the map. And he does have a changeling actually sitting in a Ukraine Star's uh Oh no, that is Ukraine Star's Changeling, actually. Interesting. But here now we go. the thing is, if Ukraine Star spreads out his force, this choke point is just going to murder... Oh, good move. Good move to use the Banelings to see that he should not try to run through. Oh, he's going to go for it, man. It's going to be very difficult in this choke. Now these roaches... Oh, and look at this. Interesting move, Sila moving back, going to his new expansion area. He's going to defend it, I suppose. For sure. The thing is, U Ukraine Star is still sitting on two bases, man. Ukraine Star has got to get another base. His main base is almost completely mined off. You know, and 20 minutes into a game, you can't live on Oh, one and base. look at this move here. Ukraine Star pushing through the middle. And it is being seen by Sela. So Sela is going to try to cut him off in the choke. And here we go. Roach on Roach on Hydra. Hydra action here. And I wasn't just what going for an echo effect. What a mess. This is this. quite the mess of bile and spines being shot across. And it looks like Ukraine Star is losing most of his forces. Sila sitting in the advantage here. And it looks like Sila will go ahead and continue to defend. It will defend against that successfully. And these uh, overlords. And that might be know, it. Ukraine Star's got no arm. Ukraine Star's got 11 man. roaches. That's it, man. Yep, it does not look good for Ukraine Star. That's for sure. 
So fail, going on move, lol, GG is called out from Ukraine Star, Rage Celia takes the win, and we're going into the next match here as Celia pushes forward and we get a Zerg victory. And it's not that laggy over here on uh, my computer that I'm watching it on. Um, it does freeze up in some in some situations, but you know you, you got to expect that with the with the stream anyway. I'm constantly working on it, trying to make it better and better. We'll see if I uh, can work that out. But uh, I'm glad you guys are enjoying the show. Thanks everybody for joining us here at Imbalance.tv. We're definitely glad to have you. We're going to go ahead and play one more trailer park before we get into the next round. And there's only one other game we can cast, so... Yeah, and if uh, Brock calls not on top of it, I sent uh, a question to RGI Wolf to get us invited as well. So there's a little visit in the Imba T or the Imba Trailer Park. That's right. We will play trailers for you guys. And we're glad you are enjoying our cast and our show. And the only the only reason we're not broadcasting a game is there's only one round seven game left. That's for sure. So everybody's waiting. Goody, Cyclo, Honor, Acro, Optic Zero, Nama are all waiting for the winner of the game that we're about to broadcast in order to continue this tournament. And you know what? To continue on with the action, I'm going to go ahead and start up the request line. This one right now goes out to High Fish. That's how I'm going to read it, man. Anyways. Das kleine Herz stand still für Stunden. So hat man es für tot befunden. Es wird verscharrt in nassem Sand. And we're working on getting you into the next match. Thanks to Mini Gris for that. And thanks to Torre for dealing with the scoreboard and doing a great job in the chat with you guys. Yo, the next match is Sila versus Roll. That's the next. That's the only match that's left. That's right. Yeah, and Roll's gonna get us the invite. Fantastic. So we will be in a game very soon, in the last game, and we would get into... Uh, we would get into the uh, Morrow game, but it's already too late for that. That's already going on, and uh, yeah, that's about it. it. And you know what? A big shout-out for Ukraine Star for one of the biggest upsets I've seen in Craft Cup history in round five. You watched them right here on Imbalance TV takeout show in a, you know, in a game that concluded with about eight plus five plus three ultra lists. That's right. Plus five 